All right, class, so here is a quick video um, for this Alex topic that is called counting the atoms in a unit cell. And this is gonna be a really important uh, skill for us to be able to, to utilize and, and do essentially as we're doing all these other sort of unit cell type problems in this chapter. So um, this is my, my question. I've got this um, you know unit cell here, so this outline in red, that's one unit. Um, and then I've got the, these different um, elements essentially or atoms uh, you know within my my unit cell so the goal here is to figure out within the box so inside of the box how many equivalents of each of these types of atoms are there inside of this box so for the white atoms at the corner um, each of these atoms at the corner has one eighth of an atom inside of the box inside of the box so if I imagine this, you know, white atom here, how much of that atom is inside of that box? Uh, it's one eighth. So each corner is one eighth of an atom. Another way to think about that would be sort of how many other unit cells will I need until that atom is entirely filled up. So that's one eighth at each corner. Um, and then I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight total. So in total, I have one atom equivalent inside of the box. So I've got one eighth for each one and then I've got eight of them so that means I've got one total. For blue atoms, so the blue atoms are next, these are on the edges here and again the the skill here, the, the thing we're looking for is how much of that um, blue atom is inside of that box. If I want to just say like you know how much is inside the box it would be one fourth of an atom. So Again, if you think about if I put another unit cell here coming sort of towards us, that would fill up half of that atom and then the other two would be on top or below in this case. Um, but one quarter of that atom is inside the box. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight total. So that would mean that there are two atom equivalents inside of the box. So two for this um, blue atom here. Now the black ones, these are what we'd call face centered. They're in the, the face of that plane. So each one of those is gonna be one half. So maybe I'll just draw it this way. One half atom inside the box again. So if you imagine that this is the plane, then half of that atom is inside, half the atom is outside of the plane. So I've got one, two, three, four atoms there, half atom inside for each. So then that would be two atom equivalents for these black atoms as well. So that's the entire concept here, just practicing, you know, counting, how much of the atom is inside the box, how many atoms do I have um, in my unit cell, and then figuring out how many equivalents, so these, I would call these atom equivalents inside the unit cell. And this exercise is gonna be useful for you know, a lot of the other topics that we're doing in this objective. All right.